Welcome to Butternut Creek School. Coronavirus edition. School's closed. School's closed. Good thing. Something that happened uh, the alumni might be not be aware of is that over here in the front playground there used to be this storage shed over here that we use for wall ball courts and there was a basketball hoop here and that stuff was all gone now this wall ball court still the same um, in fact you can even see this lower part here that really sucked for skimmers in wall ball down there also the um, what bark dust was all replaced and uh, they have a new swing set new jungle gym yeah I am seeing on the back of this wall ball court here they did repair wasn't this like a larger stone portion here with a little metal overhang or something so that's different let's see there's Mr. Bither's old room Mr. Allen's old room over there is Mr. Uh, Buell's old room there is our old exit from the um, cafeteria. And I see there's a sign on the door. I wonder what it says. Let's go see. What does that say? Well, it actually is labeled cafeteria now. That's different. <laughs> Vermont Hills Family Life Center. Enter here. Okay. That, that's different. That's different. What's going on over here, I wonder? This uh, community garden thing or whatever project is not as fenced off as it used to be. And that was a big shock when it was so fenced off too because it was fenced off. Couldn't make your way through there anymore. Um, lots of uh, signage on the doors that I'm not used to seeing. And it's been there for a bit now. But yeah. Ooh, the bike rack's gone. Check it out. That's uh, that's too bad. That was a cool bike rack. All gone now.
and they put uh, some swing sets on the side of the school here. Yes. <laughs> Now they've uh, taken, oh, huh, I see a lot of caution tape, so that tells me that either somebody put a bunch of caution tape on this stuff, <laughs> which wouldn't surprise me, um, or they're possibly going to get rid of this stuff. Huh? Oh, actually this caution tape is probably telling people not to play on these surfaces because you don't know who touched them. Probably. As you can see, the tunnel that so many kids made out in and peed in is gone. It's been gone for a few years, though. Also, the map of the United States down here, uh, you can barely see it anymore. And that's okay. Um, the spaceship is so freaking short now. I swear they buried this thing in like two feet of bark dust. Now, when I was younger, we didn't have bark dust. They just had uh, black mats. Now, I remember that my good friend Jason Nakayama fell from the top of this thing and landed splat on the ground on the mats within it, and I thought he was dead. <laughs> he wasn't dead, no, he was actually a good friend of mine. This stuff is all here still. Um, the balance beam over there, don't tell me why that's still there. I mean, if a kid's gonna get injured on anything, he's gonna roll his ankle on a bad step off of that thing. These uh, kids, Swing sets almost look taller than the ones in the front now, the big kids' playground. And there's still the uh, whatever ball court. <laughs> Nobody ever played it. Tether ball, thank you. Undercover area. Seems so much smaller than it used to be. Remember when it, the back in the rainy days when we still had recess? And we'd all have to fit under this this cover. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. Amazing we could have done that. Wouldn't be able to maintain social distance like that these days. Lots of the PAX voices. Somebody left something down here. I don't know what it is. Drink or something. <clears throat> it wasn't me. Now, I know a whole lot of dudes who peed right here in the corner. It is so gross. <laughs> I'm not going to say I haven't done it myself in the past, but, uh, yeah. Wasn't cool. It was never cool to do that. Okay, what's going on over here? I remember this area here. strike for it or something. In fact, I might have got detention from that. That might have been my first detention. I don't understand why this fence is here. Because you can seriously just walk right through it. Like I just did. But yeah, the classrooms look like they're all, they kind of have kids come back to them from the outside. Sad. Very sad. And they're coming up on the old bus turnaround. Yes.
and this tree right here in the middle right behind the sign for the school uh, was a tree that was planted in honor of Mrs. Payne who was uh, a secretary here at the school who died um, back in maybe 1984 or something nice lady the entrance has changed a whole lot um, they've got a, they've got a nice ramp here for handicapped students although it was unnecessary because this is already a ramp and I don't know what the, all this stuff's for separate the students I don't know and you can't really see in there can you a little bit there we go focused you can see my fantastic form out here videoing this for you. <laughs> um, that welcome thing at the back of the wall there, that's different. And there's a welcome back thing here. What is that? What's the welcome back for? What's that say? I don't know if that says. It's okay. Anyway, so that's different. Look at the inside there. I wonder if the old locker room is still there. Remember the old locker room? They used to have these walls here up to conceal the door to the men's locker room and conceal the door to the women's locker room back here. There's a new uh, seat. Um, that tree is different. The big tree that was here was taken. There were a few trees that were here that are gone now. This used to not be there at all. Look at that. That used to be the dirt path that was right next to a tree that people would take the shortcut down from that into the playground. Yeah. And down here by Mr. Buell's old room. I see they've taken away, have they taken away the picnic table? I don't know, but they put a fence here for some reason. I don't understand why. Now the picnic table's still there. They put two picnic tables there. That's uh, gotta be good for uh, the recess ladies, or the recess people watching over the kids so they don't have to stand the whole time yeah look there's a uh, caution tape on the new playground as well that's really too bad nice new playground not supposed to touch it uh. so yeah there's the school there's the school as we know it now not as we knew it before but yeah, look, that thing's still there. What is that thing? This big metal thing on the side of the building. I never knew what that was. Yeah. There's the uh, old... Well, that's where they used to keep the uh, playground equipment. I'm sure they still do. It can't just be garbage. Looks like it's just garbage. <laughs> but, yeah. I do believe they got rid of the pickleball court, which was great because prison was such a much more accessible game. I mean, if you could hold a ball and throw a ball, you could play prison. And there were a lot of people who threw really hard, which is the reason probably prison was gotten rid of, but pickleball, you had to have some amount of skill to hit that stupid ball with that stupid paddle. <laughs> I hated that game. Hated it. Anyway, there's the school. I hope you all enjoyed. Ooh, there's turds. Look, there's poop on the ground. That's gross. Ugh.